Hi everybody, my name is Johanna and I'm currently studying. Well, to be exact, I'm mostly done. I just need to write my master thesis, which I was supposed to finish six months ago. And don't get me wrong, it's not that I don't want to write my thesis, although to be completely honest with you, I really don't want to. But the thing is, I just can't prioritize it enough right now and also I'm very stuck with my research at the moment. So this week I decided to wake up at 6am to work on my thesis before going to work and here's what I went. <sighs> Good morning everyone, it is 6.07, I actually woke up at 6 but I couldn't figure out the coffee machine for 5 minutes but I did eventually. I also have a banana, hopefully the fact that I feel like I've been run over by a bus will distract me a little bit from the fact that I have to write my thesis because it's the absolute worst thing I've ever done in my life I ever had to do in my life and I really don't want to do it I also hate waking up early I don't even know what I hate more Somehow in my mind when I combine those two it somehow worked So let's see I have time until 8 and then I have to go to work So see you in 2 hours Okay, the sun went up, it is 8.06 and I have to leave for work like now and then I'll see you tomorrow or maybe tonight on a little update on my sleep schedule so yeah, see you, bye! I just came back from work and oh, I feel like shit, I feel like shit the whole day like in the morning when I wake wake up really really early I don't know if anyone else has it but I feel like my stomach doesn't wake up the same time as me so I, I kind of felt like dizzy and like I had to puke the whole day and then actually I was sitting at work the whole day and I'm like why does my foot hurt so much what happened and I right now I wrote in my notes today in the morning that I um, hurt my foot while running to the U-Bahn like today in the morning and I completely forgot about it so yeah my head is just also not in the right space today I, I just can't function properly when I wake up so early but then <laughs> I, f I felt like I, I was better than everyone else because I got up earlier even though it completely right until now it's like five and I still have hockey practice but until now I feel like it completely ruined my day and still I felt like like I achieved so much I didn't write like five sentences I think I wrote like three sentences to the, today in the morning on my thesis and at work I was like zoning out completely the whole time and yeah but I felt better, like the, like I was better than everyone else. I was way too hungry to cook right now and I just wolfed down some toast with cheese. But I also found something very nice in uh, Aldi. I never tried pop tarts before, but they have it in Aldi. I don't know if they like always have it or if, if it's just now, but I'm gonna pop one of these in the air fryer, I think, because we don't have a toaster. And then let's see. I'm excited. I got the strawberry flavor. Got the strawberry flavor. I broke one taking it out of the air fryer and then I gave it to the boyfriend because I'm evil genius and then I broke the other one too I do like it but I feel like a toast with marmalade will be better 
I don't know. Maybe it doesn't have the nostalgic note for me. Right out of 10? 6 out of 10. Nice job. <laughs> <laughs> last night so I had like five or six hours of sleep I'm so tired and my whole body hurts I feel like I've been hit by a bus to be fair this is probably not because I woke up this early but because I played hockey yesterday and it always makes my whole body hurt so much yeah anyways I'm gonna start writing my thesis now and I'm gonna tune in with you later something. <laughs> from work and I'm going to CrossFit and I am super scared because first of all I have to drive there alone and I hate driving and I've never went there I've never driven there so I'm scared and second of all I have not slept like over five hours so I am really tired and I'm still new to CrossFit so I hope I can do this workout and I won't die and I guess I see you later again So exhausting but it was really nice it's always so fun I mean it was my fourth time so that's why I also am scared to film yet but it was so exhausting Ooh, it's always so exhausting but it's so fun it's like 
I think except from ice hockey and boxing, one of the most fun like workouts I have ever done. I will definitely come back and keep doing this. I'm so excited to get stronger. But yeah, the weather is also really nice. But I think I'm gonna go back to work for a few more hours and then I wanna take a nap and Tonight we have my birthday dinner, already exciting, we're going for Korean food. So yeah, let's go home, shower and work a little bit more. <sighs> Guys, look what the boyfriend got me. Because I was sad because there's no present today and no cake. <laughs> and also we got the balloons. So nice. from Kos and I kind of think I may have gotten it a size small like the size small it was a little too tight but I think this one it looks it's making me very broad I don't know but maybe that's just me but yeah I'm wearing Prada boots and then Kos skirt and this is H&M and then I've seen many Korean influencers do like their hair in a bowl like this, so I tried it. camera and say something because it's getting worse and worse by the day. I feel so freaking tired right now. Can't even do anything. I'm also noticing me shifting my chores from like the afternoon <laughs> into the morning which kind of defeats the purpose of waking up early because I'm not writing my master thesis anymore. I um, need to bake a cake for work because of my birthday. I don't know how it is in other countries. My boyfriend tells me that in other countries people bring cake for you when it's your birthday, but in Germany you need to bring the cake. <laughs>
Okay, I have to leave now. The cake is done. It is in here. The cake is in here. It's not really um, cold yet, but I don't have more time. I glazed the muffins, which was a bad idea because it's also not dry yet. But I'm gonna try to pack them up. Uh, I don't know in what or I don't know. I don't have anything to like wrap them with, but I'm gonna maybe just throw them in there and, <laughs> and hope they won't look too bad. Otherwise, I'll just give the cake to my colleagues. <laughs> so embarrassing. <laughs> I'm so bad at stuff like this, but yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Okay, guys. Okay. I'm home. It's like 4 30 and I'm super hungry. We have some sushi left over, but I kind of want to leave it for the boyfriend because he was so nice to me yesterday. And you know, I just realized in the Uban that it's like the first birthday in like forever. I can't even remember the last birthday when I didn't cry. But yesterday I didn't cry. It was it was very nice. Maybe because I had like zero expectations. I didn't want to like celebrate or anything. I just went to the gym, did my usual stuff at home office, chill at home, ate some cake and went on with my family and it was just very nice. Or maybe it also is just the fact that I'm just getting older and it's not so important to me anymore. Yeah, but anyway, I'm so tired. I thought I will get used to it, but um, it's a third day now and I have had a nap every single day. I have needed a nap every single day, but I'm gonna make ramen now because I want to leave the boyfriend. Uh, I want to leave the boyfriend some sushi, as I said, and I'm also craving ramen. And yeah, let's see. So I have these two and I wanted to eat the chicken one, you know the pink one? But the boyfriend ate it yesterday, I think. Or is it pink? I don't know. Anyway, but we have these ones. I think I have never tried this before. But I know I am craving this one, so if I'm gonna eat this one and it's not like this one, then it won't satisfy my cravings. I think I'm scared of this. Because this is Jaja. That's how you say it. But like the black noodle, the black bean. Um, so I think I'll make this one. Or should I try this one? Can't decide. Well, <laughs> I'll show you in a bit. Okay, I went with the black bean ones. And I'm gonna try now. I left a little too much water because I thought I like it extra saucy, but now it's like a little too saucy, I think, and I also have some more rice in case it's um, too spicy. Mm. I actually love this. I think I just don't like the like the Chinese one. The Chinese style black noodle because it's not bean, but it's very because it's not bean, it's somehow very fishy. I don't know what they put in there. Maybe it's also bean, but this one 
It's definitely not fishy. So I like it. Also, I'm currently watching like a lot of Japan videos because we're going to Japan in one month. Mm. A little bit more than one month. But I'm so excited. I think I'm a little bit too excited. I hope it will be nice because I always get overly excited and then it's like hard to like satisfy me. And I have these super big expectations which are probably not gonna come true. But I just build it up in my head and I hope so much that um, we will have a nice trip because I'm, as I said, so excited. Hey everyone, I don't know if you're gonna believe me this or not, but I actually forgot to put my alarm today in the morning and I didn't wake up at 6 a.m. I woke up at 7.30 like my regular scheduled time and I went to work, came back, was super tired still, I don't know why, and um, we went to CrossFit. It's now half past 10 and I have my hot water bottle and I'm gonna do some meditation and then I'm gonna sleep and then I hope I'll be ready for tomorrow the last day of my challenge hi baby oh my god look at the chair full of one million clothes which I haven't cleaned for a whole week also I look insane and I have the pimples of my life but I actually did do my skincare I think it's the sleep deprivation but yeah let's do some meditation I'll see you tomorrow and Six or five thirty, whatever. <laughs> Morning, it is 6.03 and my head hurts a lot and my throat kind of hurts but yeah, one more day then it's the weekend so, oh, oh, I also wanted to show you this this is what my boyfriend got me for my birthday and so I told him I wanted it in December it's so cute got my black tea here today we went for black tea I'm gonna put some um, milk in this too later and I'm back and I showered and I washed my hair and I just quickly wanted to give you my thoughts on this week before we end this video. So 
I may have seemed like super super tired the whole week, which was true, but actually if you knew me, you know I'm not a morning person at all, so I'm actually always tired in the morning. Yeah, I just wanted to mention that in case you thought I looked super tired. Um, I was, but I'm usually tired in the morning. Was I more productive than usual though? Which is a real question. I guess I would say I have more motivation to do certain things before work than after work. So I actually was pr very productive in the morning. But the thing is, that resulted in me taking a nap every day. So all in all, I would say it was quite fun. It was quite a ni nice experience. I actually liked it more than I thought. It felt like super nice to have like some me time in the morning when it felt like everyone was asleep. Although I think like most people actually wake up at 6 a.m. I would actually know when you wake up and when you go to bed. So if you would comment that, I would be really interested in that. But yeah, I really liked it. Really had a nice week actually. Um, I'm happy you did join me and I hope to see you soon again.